Hey guys, this is the new Bizarre. I'm bringing you a quick video here on how to make a fully automated farm. So what you're going to want to start out with is a little 5 by 13 rectangle. Then you're going to come to each either side, it doesn't really matter, and count two blocks and then you're going to want to build a wall. So I already have that done. So now what you're going to want to do is start with the farm. So there's going to basically be, it's just going to be a piston that closes water and opens it and lets the water flow to harvest some crops. So that will be pushed out to there. So we're going to close that off just like that on either side. If you would like, and also you want the piston actually right about there. So get your piston and stick it in there. And then stick whatever block you want in front of it. And then just wherever that is, there'll be a two holes. So now we'll do the same thing on either side. in there, and then a whatever block you want, so then it basically looks like this. Then what you're going to want to do is get some redstone, and connect both of these to one lever. Okay, so now you have both the pistons connected to a lever. So you pull the lever, and you see both those pistons come out. That's what you want. So then, once those pistons are out, just entirely, just destroy blocks in front of it. I just destroyed the wall, but you don't need to do that. So, just you just have to destroy those blocks in front of it. And that is where the land is going to be. So you want to dig out whatever bottom layer. If it's grass, though, you can just leave it. So you want to dig out whatever bottom layer and put grass if it's not already there. And you're going to want to do the same thing on this side. So now, in the spaces that aren't where the water is, so he, this space, this space, and this space, what you're going to want to do is just dig a hole, and then pour some water in it. What this basically is going to do is just keep your crops hydrated so they can grow a little faster. So now you have the land where the two spots of water are going to be coming out. And then you have water. So destroy the blocks until the water goes like there. Until the water stops flowing, which is seven blocks. And then just destroy it everywhere. And then what you're going to want to do is on those two lanes, add it just one more thing. So just add the blocks as long as the water is going. So it stops exactly when the water does. Okay, now you're going to want to build a little, you can cut this off, just make sure the water only goes as far as the blocks. 
So now what you want to do is get your hoe and till soil. Oops, I'll have to replace that in a second. So till your soil and then plant your seeds. So all my seeds are planted. That's all right, we don't need that one for this one. So now all the seeds are planted and the pistons are out. Now what you're gonna wanna do is come back here to these little holes you have and pour a bucket of water in it. So all this is for keeping, all this here is just for keeping them hydrated. For the purposes of this video, just to make it go a bit faster, I'm just going to use bone meal on my crops to make them grow fast. Doesn't matter if I'm not on all of them. So, if your cobs are fully done, what you'd want to do is come and you press that lever, and basically the water just flows out and harvests your crops you will yeah then you just come back here close it and that's just the basic idea of it guys that one wasn't as good as my other one over here I'll show you but I was just messing around with pistons and decided to make that so here's the good one that I have. Uh -huh, okay. So what you guys want to do is don't forget to do this because that's where I messed up. You want to make sure your water lanes are covered up so like it's not showing. So just add some blocks. Cover it up just so the other water doesn't flow in there. Oh, this is the wrong farm. There we go. See how the water kind of flew over? Don't want that to happen. So what you want to do is keep that there, there you go, and then just build that right over it. You don't want to really destroy the water because it's keeping your crops hydrated. So, see, and then there we go, that works a bit better. So now that all my water lanes are covered up, so now I'll show you how it works. So there's all crops in there. You'll press this, the water will go out, go down, harvest your crops, you close it, you just go get them. It's as easy as that. Um, alright guys, thanks for watching. This is the Us. Please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. See you guys.